In 2011, we took part in the Climate Clever Energy Saving Programme. Climate Clever is an action learning project directed at energy usage at school. In Climate Clever, we learnt about renewable and non-renewable energies and we calculated our carbon footprint by using devices to measure how much energy we use as a school. HEROES is a project which was created last year in 2010. HEROES stands for Heating Energy Recycling Officers. They help to reduce the school's bills by turning off the aircon, monitors, lights and fans. And at lunch they will do this and also after school. We also did an energy audit and tested equipment such as printers, aircon, monitors and just general equipment around the school. And we learnt that classes were leaving lights and the equipment on over lunch and recess and even overnight. So they were wasting quite a lot of energy. This year we took part in the Climate Clever Expo and we discovered the benefits of solar energy through experimenting with solar cars. And we also learnt about different types of energy by experimenting with different things at different stations set around the school. This year in class we brainstormed ideas for the Climate Clever Awareness Project when we, we all had different ideas and each class had different ideas but finally we decided on one and that was the Human Sign Project and Stage 3 all put that together. It was organised out on the grass in front of our new classrooms. It was to raise awareness with the school community about the current problem of global warming and how, it has to, um, how it's affecting the world. The Human Sign Project was an idea where we'd physically set out um, a word, act now, after thinking it up in class. That was our slogan. And everyone across stage three would um, pretty much lie down on the grass and form a human sign. And it was photographed from the top of the building. And so that was going to take on our website so that it would raise more awareness with the school community. We did climb leather as a logo. And the logo is break the chain. So basically, it's the earth and each generation is a part of the chain. So it all goes into one chain and then now, in the last generation, there's a lock. And we can break that chain because we are the key in this generation. We can unlock and break the chain in global warming. In May 2000, August 2006, Brazil lost uh, 150,000 square kilometers um, of rainforest, that's a larger area than, Gre than Greece. And in 1970, 600,000 square kilometres of the Amazon rainforest have been destroyed. So we need to act now before it's too late. This year in Climate Clever, we learned about renewable and non-renewable energies, such as solar, wind, geothermal, nuclear, and non-renewable sources such as burning coal. I also studied up on the Amazon and learned that seven football fields, or 3.5 hectares of forest, is cleared every minute due to deforestation. That results in less oxygen and also less carbon stores. Well, the kitchen garden was established in 2010 and many classes were involved in planting and caring for the garden. We even have some chickens, and even the kindergartners get a help out and make some scarecrows, so they really enjoy that. And so we sell all the produce and the eggs to the local school community. In 2009, our school got a grant to install solar panels, and so in the holidays, we make electricity to feed back into the grid. I actually learnt a really cool fact it's that every minute enough energy arrives on Earth to meet our demands for a whole year, but unfortunately we don't harness it properly. And so that's why solar energy and solar power is so important. We've been recycling for a few years, but in 2010 we started the Green Team to make compost for our gardens. Well, in the Green Team we recycle, we compost, and we also do paper recycle, and we also maintain the kitchen garden, we plant seeds, we sell products and we also have chickens. In the green team I take compost off the playground into the kitchen garden bin so we can make good stuff for the kitchen garden. I 
go to the staff room and collect all the paper recycling from um, all the room. I like doing all this stuff with the environment because it's really fun and it makes you think that you're doing something. I enjoyed the way we got to get, make our proposals of what, how we wanted to help and save energy for the school. And you know, we got to present the proposals to the principal and that was quite fun. Um, I enjoyed putting on the bib and going to the staff room to recycle. And I enjoy that we're having a fountain and we're also helping the environment. Well, I enjoy raising awareness and also about global warming. Well, what I learned in Climate Clever is uh, it's not impossible if we work together to make a difference. So if one person picks up one piece of rubbish, they're all contributing to uh, the big picture and we can kick out the CO2 habits. With the Human Science Project, the reason we chose this, the words act now was because we think it's important that we act while we still have the chance to stop everything from happening. So I believe it is very important that we act as soon as possible. Yeah.